Hello again. For the past uh, two years I've been trying to teach myself how to do C Sharp. Uh, I've wanted to develop games for the Xbox Live Indie Games. And uh, for two years it just hasn't been clicking or working, figuring out the whole base foundation of how C Sharp works. So this August I enrolled in a local C Sharp class. And uh, our first project is a console application in Windows where uh, we have to make a robot car. And it has to be a text-based uh, menu driven application where you can make a car that can turn left and right and move forward and also it has to be able to turn on a spray so that as it moves it marks where it's been on the text based array and then you have to just print out the results of moving the car around on the screen so this is my uh, application for the robot car project So this is my robot car text-based application. Uh, up here in the corner, the magenta arrow represents the actual car object itself, and you can move it around on screen. Uh, you can see through a bunch of Unicode characters whether you're facing north, northwest, west, south, etc., etc. You can use the uh, S to shift gear so that instead of moving uh, one square at a time, you move three or six. So now it makes jumps around the screen. And then you can turn on the spray with key presses, and then you start moving around and placing blue dots. You can change the color. Now it's doing cyan dots, then red dots, yellow, and green. And you can change what happens with the walls, because on third gear, when you hit a wall, you slide down it sliding across the wall. If you change your wall type by pressing the B button, you can change that to bounce. So now when I hit a wall, I'll deflect off of it and bounce around in a circle around the grid. You can also set the wall type to uh, sticking so that when you hit, you'll just hit the one square and stop immediately. And then the last type of wall property I have in there is wrapping so that when you go from one side, you actually go to the other. So you jump from one wall over to the other side and start moving around, placing dots there. You can also change the spray type over to nomming so that you can go back and eat all the little dots that you placed on the screen. Nom, 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 nom. Nom. And, uh, oh, and you can wipe the color. So if all the dots on screen, if you want them all to be one color, so right now it's blue, set them all to blue, set them all to cyan, set them all to red, set them all to yellow. Set them all to green. You can reset the grid and then reset the car back to the upper right hand corner. So that's my uh, console app and you can just press the P button to quit.